All right, so today we're going to take a look at batch renaming a folder of identical files. Boring! But could come in handy, so let's do it anyways. What do you think? So what we're going to do is we're going to rename all the files in this folder over here to contain a .txt extension. Because when they were saved originally, they were saved without an extension. So we want to associate all of these files in this folder with the text editor with a .txt extension. So we're gonna open up PowerShell and we're gonna type CMD and then we're gonna press enter. And then we're gonna change the directory that we're gonna be working in. So we're gonna type CD space. And if we're gonna be working on a different hard drive altogether, we're gonna type a forward slash and a capital D and then a space and then the folder path. But today we're just gonna be working on the C drive. So we're gonna type CD space and then the folder path. To get the folder path, it's pretty simple. What we're gonna do is we have a folder open over here to the right that we're gonna be working in. So we're going to highlight the breadcrumb navigation style menu up here. And that's going to turn the folder path more into your traditional folder path style format. And then we're going to copy that, pressing Control C. And then we're going to come over to PowerShell and we're going to press Control V to paste it in there. And then we're going to press Enter. And that's going to tell the system that we're going to be working from within that directory. So now we're going to type REN, short for rename, and then space an asterisk and then a dot What? and then we're going to press the space bar and then we're going to type an asterisk and a dot followed by txt mm -hmm. and that's pretty much the extent of the command that's all we're going to be doing Whoa. after we hit enter that command is going to say everything in this folder that has dot nothing we're going to rename to .txt. We're going to append the extension on every one of those files in that folder with a .txt. So we're going to press enter and we're going to watch the magic happen. Mm -hmm. Enter. Boom. Every one of those files was just renamed with the .txt extension. Wow. And if you wanted to rename image files, or if you wanted to rename PHP or HTML files, or whatever you're working with, this could come in handy so that way you don't have to go down and rename every single file individually. So, the next time you need to batch rename a group of files in Windows, this is a method you can use. Give it a try. Hopefully this helps resolve a similar issue on your system as well. And to do this, we're going to utilize Windows 10 Command Prompt or PowerShell. And this allows us to go into a folder and change a group of files. the same time.